Hello my guys, once again Ugani man, as always. Today, what's in the kitchen? Omena, omena. Omena is one of the most delicious meals that we need for maintaining our health. But a lot of people have got problem uh, preparing this one. But today, I want to show you the simple tips that will make your omena more tastier, less smelly for your health. Just follow me. Step number one to keep the bitterness, bitterness in omena, just soak it in the hot water. So we're going to place it here inside the bowl. Oh yes. Like that. And pour hot water. And leave it to soak for a while. As it soaks, let's do something. Uh, cut your lemon, pour on top, through the whole outer covering, leave it to soak. The next step now, let's go ahead and now cut our tomatoes because I want us to do what we call tomato puree. So we'll just do them in small pieces, then we cook them up. Good. Ah, I'm telling you, the omena we are going to do today, you won't believe your eyes. Just stay tuned and see this technique. It is technique one and a half plus a quarter because our omena is going to be a five-star meal. A five-star meal that has never been seen before. It is a meal that you yourself, after having watched this video, you will love to do it immediately by yourself. Okay, we place our cut uh, tomatoes onto the or inside the pot. Light the fire. Good. And we have to cover it. Let me get the cover. Oh, yes. with that to cook as it cooks eh, we can also do uh, our uh, onion for later use because we'll use it when we are doing the frying so just to make everything ready very important to save time so let's do this small pieces like that good And keep it aside for later use. Guys, hakia mungui ili omena tuta kutengeneza hapa. And remember, today is omena. Look at this. Milk is also there. So just imagine the milk that is going to be on the table this morning. Very heavy. Okay. The next step now. I'll use this. This one is the best. Let me use that one. Okay. See the next step as we try to de or fry our omena. Don't go away. Yes, our omena is now well soaked. We can now rinse it into cold water. So let's go for rinsing. Remove the whatever. Try just to mix it up. And remove this water. So. Get the cold water to rinse. Good. Why are we doing this? We are doing this just to remove the alkalinity or bitterness. Ukali kwa omena. And again, pour off out the water. Let's 
awesome. Uh, you remember our put tomato puree? Tomato puree is here. It's bubbling almost. I think it's not almost. Smash it a little bit. We'll use it to make this omena more delicious. Huh? Right. We need the pan now. Okay. So basically what we do here, we want to dry this, the omena, remember, it's wet, it has got some water, so first of all let's make them dry, then I'll give you the next step, what's to be done. But guys, believe me or not, the omena that is going to come out of here is omena that you've never witnessed before. Remember my program teaches you how to cook and also get the best uh, meal that uh, can enhance your health apart from some of the times we do some comedy on top but if you're keen you will see these meals that i do are organic meals that will enhance your health okay just try to awesome So we have our tomato, or rather, kitungu, <laughs> then uh, uh, milk, eh? you see? So salt is also there, and we need the mafuta, oil, very important in this process. Yes, the omena is drying up. Drying up, yeah. There's some big, we are we can remove them. Mm. All right, right, as it dries up, awesome. Let's meet in that next process of now frying. Okay, it's now time for frying. Now we have to add this oil. Pour the oil. Awesome. Oh, wow. Can you hear the sizzling sound? Nice. Then we add the onions on top. A little bit of salt. And mix it up. Mix it up like that. Guys, you just wait. You'll see the omena that is coming here. <laughs> Don't get away. Awesome, 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 awesome. Awesome. Good. Oh, you can hear the sizzling sound, eh? That means it's a nice cooking going ahead. Uh, let's talk a little bit about omena. Uh, why would you eat omena? What are the benefits of omena? One thing, omena has got high calcium. The work of calcium is to uh, build our bones, make them denser and healthier. Then it also has got a high source of protein. Protein to repair uh, the bodily worn of tissues. Um, it's good and healthy if you can have omena twice or thrice in a week to gain the all-rounded benefit right okay let's go back to the main and see this is it Fine up 
Then we add the, our tomato puree. Remember it? Sorry. And mix it up. Oh, yeah, it smells nice. Oh, wow. What best meal can you eat with omena? I prefer ugali. But was kudanganya rice, ingiani, ama mchele. Omena goes well with ugali. Hiki tu bwana ni ugali tembezi bwana na tembeza inakufanya unapepeta ugali bwana. Ugali kabisa bwana. Ugali naisha bwana within no time, eh? All right. Look at that omena. And now, do you remember this ingredient? Very important. To boost it with more protein. Milk on top. Then leave it to bubble for a while. Ile chakula tunataka kukula hapa saa hii asubuhi. Ah, walibakisha kaugali eh? Let me get that kaugali here. Oh wow. Is it? Ugali ya jana. Put it aside. Oh yes. See how it's bubbling? And it's time to eat. Let's serve. Let me take you. Let me take you to the dining hall. We have the meal together. <laughs> you can feel the onion inside is crunchy. The man is soft. It's not smelling bad. Mm, there's no bitterness. It's just sweet more than a chicken. Guys, you should try this, eh? We should try this today. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, what a nice meal. Wow. Oh, wow. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, 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 mm. Wow. Wow. The milk inside, huh? Make the soup more thicker. Oh, wow. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wow. Oh. <clears throat> this morning I'm having. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, wow. Minute. Mm -hmm. Wow. 
Thank you much. Mm. Thanks so much, guys. I'm now good. See you again tomorrow and see what will be on the table. Thank you.